Welcome back to Darkwood. Managed to get through the night completely unscathed, other than being thoroughly creeped out. Allowed us to not spend a single shot of anything. So, I have the luxury of now having a loaded shotgun and a single additional shotgun shell. Woohoo! So I sold some things, including a shiny stone and the shovel head that I found, since I don't need a, another shovel head. Sold it to the trader. Bought shotgun shell, a small caliber magazine. I bought both of the fuels. Used that to process all the wood I found. Some wires, some rags. Allowed me to make two lockpicks. Yeah, I'm actually quite low on fuel. So the trader seems to have two fuels every morning. And I think the past two mornings I've bought them. And I only have one fuel left. So I don't want to be using it to make Molotovs. And I have no alcohol left, surprisingly. So, I'm just gonna live with these two Molotovs, I guess. I really am curious what this welder's for. Wait, was that used for the... That was used for the previous upgrade tier, wasn't it? I think it was, for the workshop. Now we need something new. Hmm. Okay. Well, I think we're ready to head out. So I'm gonna head back to the church, now that I've got a free inventory and more time. I've also got two lockpicks, so I can open both of those chests. I don't think I'm gonna take this pathway to get there, though. Because there were a lot of enemies along that pathway. Including, I think, two dogs and, like, at least one chomper. Maybe I'll just head straight down. Let's go ahead and eat this bread. Yeah, let's try straight down. I just get the feeling of dread around this place. Alright, let's check out those chests. Pills and alcohol. Shovel blade. Another thing I can sell for a lot. Cool. I'm gonna put my torch on. Lantern, rather. They're still there. Oh, these move. I wonder if there's anything beneath them. Doesn't seem like it. They're not big enough to really hide anything, I would think. So, oh, I forgot to bring gas for the generator. Whoops. So yeah, the generator leads down here. Right? Still needs a password. Just like it did in the 
quote unquote vision. Some stuff I dropped. Logs? Yeah, just logs. Ah, and a shovel blade too. Another thing I can sell. Yeah, so it's just the generator. So no point in doing anything with that. Unless I can get down there. What is up with that person? Why are they there? Why are they wheezing and... Ooh, what's this? Scrapping a reg. Seems to be it for this place. I really am very curious what is beneath that trap door, but at the same time, that person there said that you deserve to be... What? Down... down there? So it makes me think it's a bad place? If they hate me and they think I deserve to be there? Can't be good. Okay, um... Where to from here? I could try to look at some of the unexplored areas. In particular, here and here, there's probably some stuff. I could go to the northeast and look for the wolf. And pray I don't have to go into the barn ruins. See if the wolf is maybe right here. It's about the only place I could have missed them, I think. Unless... Wait a minute. Is that a path there? Like an off-map path? Kind of like this one, maybe? Like the road to the village? That's worth investigating. I could also go down here and see if I missed something here that might lead me to the key to the strange box. Because remember, I'm still looking for that. I want to look for the key to the strange box. And I'm relatively close to that area, so let's go there. Let's look more thoroughly in the southwest. along the forest's edge. What's that? Oh, it's a body. Ooh. Alcohol and some bear traps. Let's process these into scrap. There we go. Save some inventory space. body died to that tree. Okay, forest's edge. Let's go along here. We should hit the bridge pretty soon, where we came into this forest. Yep, there it is. Okay, skirt right along the edge. I guess it's possible I might be skirting too close to the edge. Wherever the key is might be a little bit further out from the edge. It's definitely possible. We'll see. That's twitching. Have I been here? I know I went to this general area, but have I been specifically here? Okay, I've been here. I remember I looked at the train tracks. Hmm. Southwest. I mean, this could it could be this entire area, I suppose, right? The southwest? It is to the south, and it is to the west. Hmm. I already followed that. Is this a thing I can go down? No. Hmm. I feel like there's something more here. Oh. 
Ooh. Okay, well, there's a mushroom man. Let's not bother them. Oh. I heard something moving. I think that's a big dog. Ooh. Oh, already, I've already searched it. Here we... No, wait. I've already been here. Damn it. <laughs> okay, I guess there's just nothing more in this area. Alright then. Hmm. Well, I don't think I really have time to run all the way up here, so let's explore... Let's explore... Here? This area, maybe? Or above. Let's go northeast and head up to this area. So much stuff. My inventory is full now. Well, actually, since my inventory is full, how about we head straight to the house and then explore to the north of it so I can dump off all my stuff? That sounds good. Oh, God. Da. Okay, hold on. Alright, should have done that to begin with. I probably shouldn't walk in here. Oh! Yeah, that's not good. There's a chest there. Have I searched it? I haven't. I don't have a log pick! That's not what I wanted to happen, but at least I'm home. And the damage is really no big deal, because I can just drink from the fountain. Or the well, rather. Okay. I think I've got some mushroom. Yep. I'd be surprised if I make it to the next dose. Let me dump my, dump my stuff real quick and then head to the north. Okay. All set to go. And uh, just to speed things up, I'm going to dismantle this. Hope I don't regret that. Okay, so going north for the first time. My lantern's about to wear out, by the way. And I couldn't craft another one. I don't have enough empty bottles. Made some more Molotovs, though, since I've got the alcohol for it. Road. It's a proper road. Of course, it doesn't lead anywhere, except to a bunch of roots. Oh, there goes my lantern. By the way, I sold my flashlight because I thought I would never need it. Well, I was wrong. I've got batteries, but no flashlight at home. I thought I could just keep making lanterns, but at some point I ran out of empty bottles. Ooh. 
Looks like a like a warning sign. No, oh, yeah, just a simple roadblock. Area closed. Ah, not locked. Good. Empty Chalicate? I think it's supposed to be chocolate. Contained a chocolate-like product. Even if there was anything left inside, its best before date expired in 1979. That dog sound sounded like it came from, like, this direction, but I don't see how it could have. So I'm right here. Let's see what's here in this little dip. Oh, is it just the end of the road? On the other side? Yeah, I think so. That's surprising. Running on the pavement doesn't use less stamina. That's not considered a road, but a dirt path is. Weird. Let's try straight down, see if there's anything between here and the hideout, like right here. Some wood over there. Oh, we got a puppy. Run. Okay. Hmm. Well, I got a bit more time. Let me dump some stuff real quick. See if we have enough time to actually explore something. I dumped wood and that on the ground. Nails, boards. Still can't make a torch. Okay. Actually, just before I settle up for the night, I'm just going to get some boards and nails on me. Just to make sure I have everything for the night and some traps. So when we come back, we're done. I guess I've got like, I don't know, a half hour to explore. I'll just see if there's anything here, kind of east, a little bit south. Huge field. I know, I know. Yeah, just a whole lot of nothing. Ooh, that's something. Big dog. This is a swampy place. Sorta. Of. Oh, is this heading to the church now? Yeah, okay. Alright. Let's head home. That sounds... that's a chomper. We're gonna keep running.
Okay. Now we wait. That's definitely a dog. Okay. Okay, there's no way that's gonna miss, right? Let's go make another chain drop too. Yeah, I think the dogs have a hard time getting through barricades. Makes sense. It's gonna get through it though. Anticipation's killing me. Come on, please. It hurt me a little bit. Jesus Christ. It looked like the door wasn't hurt at all, though. I think the dog might not be hurting the door. Fucking hell. Oh, okay. Almost every night. So is that door hurt at all? Oh, it is a little bit hurt, but I mean, it was wailing on it all night. And it's barely hurt. And for all I know, it could have already been hurt. I'm not sure. Okay. Well, I think I'll end this episode here. And when I return, it looks like it is definitely time to go to the northeast. So I'm going to look around here for the wolf and the doctor a little bit more, especially what looks like maybe a pathway off the map, possibly, right here, and this area here. And if I can't find anything here, I think I'm going to have to head to the barn ruins. <laughs>